I think every time you drive up to one of these venues with 40 or even 50 pounders, you sort of get a chill in your body and you get visions in your head about what you could actually catch. Well, these visions became reality. Well, we've just done the draw and listen to this. I've pulled peg 34 on the causeway. My cousin Tom's pulled peg 33 and Dan, my brother's peg 32. So we're all next to each other and there's fish boshing out there. So yeah, I'm in peg 34. There's about 25 wraps I've got, which is a nice distance. I like that. Just setting up now. So I'll catch up to you when we're putting the rods out. Let's do it. Well, that is all three rods out. I'm just standing away from the wind at the minute. They all went out absolutely lovely on the money. Gonna leave them about three hours or so. We've got Tom down here, just about to get a couple rods out, aren't you? Me and, me and Tom have made up a plan. Um, just put some rods out, no spawning. Just see if we can nick a bite, because there's definitely fish out in front of us. So that's what we've done. I've put three bags out and uh, yeah, Tom's gonna put two bags out and a gerbin rig, so gonna leave that till about three o'clock so about two three hours and yeah see if we can nick one of these beautiful carps right so here we go now i've got some stickers in there oh, right. here we go so first fish what are we gonna do for the first person to catch a fish here on this social on b2 at linear fisheries so we're gonna kick it off with a whole bag of our new mixes you've got two different size pellet in there infused with the flat spot and that's five kg in there in our new bag so one of them also a sticker pack so one sticker pack there the new the two rhinos pig stickers on there and a new rhinos pig sticker so one of them also the brand new parker baits buckets nosa pig buckets i've just got my hands on my hands <laughs> with a kilo of bait it gets better rob magic beans 12 miles it gets better a bag of salt <laughs> oh. gets better and a flat spot and a flat spot oh, and to finish it off oh last one oh a Parker Bakes OG Fruit and Nut Bake Spray. First fish personally delivered by myself and Robin Steve. Let's get it. Come Good on. luck. Right, well, I've just had an absolute palaver with a swan. Just wiped my middle rod out. And uh, yeah, just before that, Richard come and said hello. You should, you guys remember Richard from B1? He come over while I caught that fish, gave me the luck. Right, so Richard has actually brung me some solid bag mix, which is OG fish. And the fruit and nut one. A couple of pre-tied solid bags. So thank you for that, Richard. Right. I do really appreciate that. And uh, yeah, let's give him a go. Come on, the B2 fish. Let's do it. A little update. Found the spot, 23 and a half wraps ish. Put two rods on it, went absolutely beautiful. About 20 spawns over the top. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can bag a carp in the next hour. Let's see. Come on. Right then, so I've just finished putting some bait out. And Tom next door, putting some bait out as well. Got a similar mix. I've got a little bit of pellet and boily, a lot more boily and pellet in mine, but yeah same distance i found a lovely gravel spot i mean it's about four or five foot exactly where i wanted it rod couldn't have gone out any better and yeah we just gotta wait now and hopefully the fish come and have a little munch but that was a fish bosh
Oh, yeah, he's on this though. Tick, 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 tick. He is moving. Well then, first fish for me, I was just wrapping up the spawn rod, ripped off, and I mean ripped off. Look at this bang on. Lovely fish, and uh, let's get her back. Right then, second fish for me, B2. Um, yeah, that puts me joint first on the leaderboard for most fish. And yeah, brown natural magic bean doing the do. Lovely stuff, solid bag. Put a few more spots out, rods back out. Let's get back and have another one. Bosh. Let's get back. I thought I'd do a little update for you all. And it's about half eight, eight o'clock, something like that. They're still showing out there like mad. Um, I ain't had anything since that little common. Put the left hand rod straight back out on the money. Two spawns on the money. And yeah, I'm just hoping now. So yeah, tomorrow I'll run you through my mix, my rigs, hook baits, anything like that. Anything to do with the rod side of things. And yeah. We're gonna have some dinner soon, so I'll see you soon. Bosh. Chef Tom has whipped up a storm. Look at that. Chick oh, chicken and chorizo rolls. We've got yeah. Tom here. Bang on, bro. Thank you for that. No problem. Come on, a car. <laughs> yes, please. Number three. <laughs> Well then, I get woken up. What's the time? Like one? Something like that, yeah. I lost track of time. Up. It is absolutely tipping down and I get absolutely soaked. But I give Steve a ring because I say, don't know if it's a 20, but I've got a banger in the net. So Steve come round, 22.6. Lovely linear. What a fish, mate. We'll have to show you the other side of this one. So yeah, do that now. Here we go. Here's the other side. <laughs> what belt on this puts me joint in first most fish yeah that's the one but yeah not really fast catching fish i'm happy yeah i'm gonna get them rods back out get a few spawns topped up hopefully we have a couple more <laughs> fish number three off she goes well hopefully you can see me i'm absolutely drenched making solid bags just had another fish absolutely drenched mate had to take my jacket off. I'm just soaked. I had to put the waders on in the end. So yeah. Tell me what's going on, Mr. Fisher with G. Well, throughout the night, it was absolutely pouring down. I don't know if someone updated <laughs> Nope. Yeah, I had a fish about one o'clock. Got absolutely drenched, put loads of more spawns out, got them both out back on the money. And yeah, screamed off again. So hopefully we'd hand it. Hopefully it's a 40. Because what's up. next door, Jay? There's a low 40 next door. Fish number four for me. Not going to keep it out long. I've got number five in the net. Tom's got one in the net. And uh, yeah, we're going to get her back. 18 pound. Bosh. Well done, mate. Well done. Well, look at that. Early morning wake up call over in Tom's peg in peg 33. Changed the spot yesterday back to 18 wraps. And how big, mate? 41 too. 41 pound, two ounces, his first ever UK 40, never had a 30. Barely lifted. <laughs> Barely lifted, it's his second fish out of linear and his first fish out of B2 and he's struggling so we're going to let him get this back because he's absolutely struggling. Well done mate, well done. 33.8. Absolute banging mirror, it's got like an overslung head, almost like the Punisher, but yeah, what a fish. So uh, I think we're going to get in the water, get a nice double shot, so see you then. Right, first fish for me, 41 2. And my arms are dead. <laughs> New PB? New PB as well. Happy days, like see a gold back. There she goes. <laughs> Happy days. Lovely. Jay, what have you got in the net, mate? I've got a 33 and a half pounder. Lovely mirror, fish number five. Nice. Again. 
Yeah, back door. Jay. Jay. You want to step to the left, mate? <laughs> <laughs> Go on! Fish number six. 26 and a half pound mirror. Um, solid bag. Natural magic bean brown. Seems to be the match the hatch sort of approach at the minute. Um, yeah, over the spot. 23 wraps. Fish number six. I'm in the lead with most fish now. And uh, yeah, the rod's straight back out. Few spawns over the top. Hopefully we have another one. So we'll get her back. See you then. Fish number six. Beautiful mirror. Let's get her back. Well then I thought I'd do a little update for you all. It's actually raining at the minute. I've had six fish. Puts me the top of the leaderboard for most fish. And I'm second for biggest fish. Obviously my cousin with first place with the 41 pounder. New PB. Absolute banger mate. So yeah. Little update, um, rods are out on the money, spoms are out, um, yeah, and I'll run through the bait and what I'm doing a little bit later on. It's about 10 o'clock-ish, still early days, come on a car. And it's about 4 o'clock, I think, something like that, and yeah, nothing to update. There's a few fish showing in the middle still, not too many though, and the wind is absolutely savage. So yeah, but the rods are on the money, spoms are on the money. So hopefully they return and we have another one. Come on the car. Connor has absolutely had it off today. Fair play to Connor, that's what he does, smashes it. I think he's had six or seven in the last hour or something. <laughs> something stupid like that. You're an animal, mate. Well in. What an angler. But yeah, I got the rods out. It's currently 7-7, seven, seven, so we're neck to neck. See who can get the most fish. And uh, yeah, see if we can have one. Hopefully, we have a couple tonight. Hopefully, Connor does as well. Keep it neck and neck. Come on a car. itchy stuff going into the last eight hours of the social fish number eight for me puts me joint first with most fish with connor the rod is straight back out on the money a few spoms over the top and i think i could be in for another one so yeah we'll see what we can do come on the carp come on the park baits let's get back and hopefully have a few more let's do it fish number nine for me 22 pound mirror absolute banger got another one in the net so yeah it's kicking off not sure how many Connors on. Steve won't tell me, so yeah, banger. Let's get the other one out. Fish number two of the double take. 21 pound, two ounce. Lovely slate grey mirror. They're all like this in here. Nice big shoulders on them. Fantastic fish. Love linear fish. And yeah, this is fish number 10. So hopefully I'm in first. I'm sure I'll update the scoreboard. Not yet though. If I've got a weight, you guys have got a weight as well. So uh, yeah, lovely stuff. What a crazy morning. I've had yeah, quite a few fish this morning. And uh, yeah, it's just been mental to be honest. All fruit and nut wafters, all solid bags, all on the same spot. What I'm actually gonna do in a second is put a few more spots out. Uh, keep, keep introducing a bit more bait. See if they turn back up, because it's gone a little bit quiet now for about an hour. So I'm gonna put a, lot, a little bit more bait out, see if they come back. And hopefully they do, but yeah, it's still raining. Horrible weather, but lovely for fishing. So that's the update. Hopefully, I can have a few more. Come on, the car. Fish number 11. What was it, 21.5? 21.5. Absolute banger. It's quite a little round one, isn't it, mate? Nice, very nice. Banger. This comes to the left-hand rod, absolutely screamed off. Whew, what a fish. We'll get some pictures, get her back, and uh, soon be time to pack away, I suppose. And so you've seen, I've landed quite a few fish today. I'm on 13 fish, got one in the net. I'm about to get that out right now. So uh, yeah, let's get it out. Right, fish number 13 for me. 
absolute banger. I've got some purling scales on her. 26 pound. Yeah, we're gonna get her back. Hopefully we have another one. Whoa. So yeah, what a banger that was. Um, it's about time to reel in the rods. So I'm gonna reel the rods in, go round to the point for the um, sort of, I'm in. Right then, fish number 14 for me. Absolute banger, 29 pound on the nose. Lovely fish to end the session off. And yeah, we get her back, go round to the old point, and uh, yeah, see how I did. Come on and cut up. Right, so there it is, another Parker Bay social. Um, I hope everybody's enjoyed it. I certainly have myself. Um, so first of all, massive round of applause for everyone. Now, I thought it would be a little bit different as opposed to doing a normal presentation. What I wanted to do is I want to touch on a couple of key points. I'm sure Rob will elaborate on this as well. Um, but first of all, 65 fish out across the pond. I know we said at the beginning of this, we were like, it's going to do 100 plus fish. It obviously hasn't done that, but I think we've more than explained that over the duration of this video. Because of the weather conditions, it's been so up and down, it really hasn't made the angling easy at all. I'm sure you all agree. Um, so... What I wanted to do is, I just was so 60, 65 fish, which again, very, very good, with 30s thrown in the mix. Now, what I wanted to do is, before I touch on the main trophies, is just touch on a couple of people that have standed out for me in this particular social. Rob's also going to pick one as well. Part of the people um, that have won trophies, you know they are in your head. So the first person for me was Sam. Now, there he is, the gentleman there. Um, very very refined angling lovely just lovely to watch you sit back when someone knows what they're doing you can certainly see it and that was that sam sat there had his fish deal with the fish mate i need to get my rod no 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 i need to get my rod out mate it went bang straight in the spot tip up bang lovely straight down sinks the line like just naughty on point everything about it was on point with that, he's had another fish and another fish. The thing that I loved about him as well, I know it's in the same way doing my own angling, he's like picking up the tips of his rods, just checking that he's absolutely fishing. You know, not, not, not to the foot, to the inch. And that was something that stood out for me. So, mate, if you want to come up, and us give Sam a round of applause. There it is, mate. So, Rob, you can Right, well, I'm going to go with Jake Archer. Um, basically, he's always been quite open with his casting. He's not that he's not that confident with it. But we spent what hour would you say down there? Yeah, with him? good hour and a hour bit. Hour and that mate, yeah. and he's casting and he's practicing and he's been going at him. We've been watching him. I mean, we've been living behind him for two days, so we've been watching him. And yeah, he's just been sat there practicing con uh, continuously. Throughout the 48 hours, mate. 18 wraps. 18 wraps. He was pretty Before much was the big, the longest you've had. 26 wraps. It's one thing going, yeah, I can cast 26 wraps, but actually catching a fish at 26, which he done. So, so Jake, mate, yeah, no, I totally agree with Rob on that. Massive round of applause. There he is. There's uh, some, some of that. Some of that for you, mate. Well done, mate. Shake around. Well done. Well done, mate. <laughs> no, boy, I'll, I'll, I'll leave myself hanging. <laughs> now, this is the last one for me. We've got one other goodie bag at the back there. Now, this this gentleman has been on a couple of socials. Very good angler and always seems to wingle them out. And he's been sort of picking up fish throughout the duration of the, uh, throughout the whole match, to be honest with you. And that gentleman is Joe. Now, Wanna go over there, he's had a couple of he's had a couple of good ones, mate, ain't you, over the duration, but also fishing on point, being out, getting it done. So anything else you want to elaborate on that? I mean if we could pick it up left, right, and centre, any really. I know it's been coming, but it's been sort of becoming in drips and drabs, mate. Last social you've done well. This social, I wouldn't have said you were in the best peg, if I'm honest. But you've made it happen and you've had some fish from it. So I'll shake you around, mate. Thank you, mate. Thank you, now we've done something on, slightly yeah this is a d <laughs> make sure he gets 57 percent discount going forward yeah <laughs> happen. fish is on point and i mean on point his spawning is on point he also got the girls involved this particular um session you know like being able to do that and not take it too seriously that you sort of go no 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 giving the rods to the girls girls did it and the girls nailed it as well um this gentleman also helped parker bates qualify 
<laughs> it brings tears to my eyes when I say this, because I mean, and a massive shout out to Joe Beaverstock because he's not here. Um, Rob as well, but Connor was a big part in that as well. He was there, they fished at Farlow's and they'd done the, the British, uh, <laughs> well, the European, the European right? Angling Carp Championships. It's me saying oh, European, it's just mad for me to say that. And Connor, again, alongside his angler, he put it in, uh, uh, tell me if I'm wrong, but everybody around the lake, when he had fish in front of him yesterday, it was ridiculous. Stop. Absolutely <laughs> ridiculous. Stop. But there's one thing having fish in front of you and not taking advantage of them, but he was certainly taking advantage of them and more. You know, treble takes, and it was just, it was just carnage. Hey, Ben, Ben, put a swam out. I'm like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hanging swans out for him, but we always worked at a team. My brother from another mother, and that is Connor. So, well done, massive of all, massive. So this is the standout prize for Parker Bates. Well done. Yeah. Make these Parker Bates social even more special. And he's certainly done that with this trophy. So we've got a it says on here, Parker Bates, B2 social, biggest fish. And this is um, someone that supported me for a long time. I think it was the 86th um, order customer that come in when Parker Bates first started. A lot of people at the beginning of Parker Bates said, oh, here we go, another bait company. But there was very various people in front of us that supported me and my family to help us pull us through to new levels. Um, <laughs> yeah, really does make me happy. This gentleman was over there just on the, uh, in the middle of the, the causeway over there and nicked a couple of fish and then nicked this absolute monster. PB before this was? 27. 27 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> 27 pounds. Um, so here it is, a new PB. And the biggest, there it is, the biggest fish, this lovely trophy, goes to Tom. <laughs> 41 Well done, mate. Massive oh, crowd. Well 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 <laughs> right, brilliant. Uh, what we're going to do is, mate, you've also won 5 kg of bait if you message them. Um, no, actually, no, you haven't. You've won 10 kg of bait because you've got a 40 plus. As Parker Bates, the Nossa Hunt, we've done 5kg, plus another 5kg for this, mate, you are laughing. <laughs> Absolutely laughing. So, well done. Contact Steve, what he's got. Sorry I haven't got it in front of me today, but it's even better for you if you can tailor pick what you want at the Parker Bates store, and we'll send you over a personal discount code. That you You'll use. get store credit. So you got store 50 credit. next, eh? Hey? Yeah. 50 credit. Yeah. Well, I've said 30, actually. Well, yeah, you've got to get the 30s. <laughs> Ooh, right, Ooh. here it is. Big now size. I know there's a few people twitchy because this was tight, so there it is. So on this particular one, for people that can't see, it's Parker Bates B2 Social Most Fish. The biggest, biggest fish being 33, 33 8, and also 14 fish. And then someone else caught. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. Jay's won it. Massive round of applause. And you won it by like six minutes. You actually won it by quite a lot. I was just <laughs> so if anybody wasn't aware, if anybody wasn't aware, um, what we done, <laughs> what we done is I was putting up in the chat. I was putting on there confirmed he didn't have the fish. So I put on there like um. 26.9 and a 27 Connor, yeah. for Connor. He yeah, didn't pack these fish, I was just winding up Jay. But also, just off the back of this as well, Jay, you're not going to like me, but you are going to be getting wet because you won most fish. And that's oh. the first oh. <laughs> so he's going to be getting wet. So well done to Jay, mate, seriously, well done. And another one of my good mates that's also supported Parker Bates, my family from almost day dot, mate, didn't you? Yeah, Remember staying out here over your house early stages when we went out, done some filming together. There he is, the main man, he's done well, fished his absolute backside off. He was out there in the thick of it when he was absolutely peeing it down and Jay was out there swamming. You were putting bait out. I, I, I won't yeah, I have to say numbers, but I said, you, how much bait out? And you went, a lot, yeah, <laughs> was your response, a lot. Taking the other two swings bait. That's probably <laughs> and you've also turned around and said, well, mate, well, I'm not doing all right here. Can I have some bait? You were nicking it off the people next to you. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> so there it is, a massive, massive, one more round of applause for Jay. Now, right, so there it is, another Parker Bait social, and these two are going to about to get absolutely soaked. It's been a great one here, but let's see them get absolutely wet. Right, two, one, go! <laughs> So 
That's a wrap for another Parker Bates social here at the Parker Bates YouTube channel. I hope you like this one, guys. If you have, give us a thumbs up. Make sure you comment down below. Smash that subscribe button so you don't miss any videos going forward. Happy Blue and Days. Peace out.